Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to the UK video and I've been wanting to make this for the past few days. So I think we need to talk about what's going on with the game. So I think we've got a formula down. Every, every event is basically the same. You do the normal mode, there's a little bit of story. Some of it's okay, some of it's not okay, you know. There's, there's, re, uh, there's boost for characters. Certain characters, you may have some of them, you may not have some of them. Things like that. There's a shop. Has pretty typical stuff in it. There are some tickets, which I actually like. They give up blue and the, the rainbow tickets, which is good. Hopefully that stays, because that is important for the game to go forward and positively. And you do the normal, then you wait a long time, and you finally get to do the hard mode, and it only lasts for a little tiny bit. Like the like, it feels like uh, maybe this is probably not this is probably not true, but it just feels that way. It feels like the normal mode is way longer than the hard mode that stays. It, the hard mode barely stays very long, and you're already it's already over with. So that's one problem with this game. I think is the event is very simple. It's not very engaging. Um, there's not much going on with it. This is kind of the, this is kind of the event structure going forward, and so, and then sometimes we'll have like the Christmas or the Chainsaw Man collab where it will be like an explore like a, there'll be an exploration map. And you can get some stuff here and there. I guess that's cool. But where's the where's the variety here? Where's more of the content? Where's more content at? There's one event every every now and then. Then when you go into the arc, we. If you're if you've been playing since day one, you're gonna be able to beat all this stuff in like five minutes. You do arena in like uh, well like a few minutes. Interception on auto takes only a few minutes. Simulation room if you can go to, to the last level C, it only takes like less than five minutes. So I guess it takes longer. And then one level of tribe tower for for the daily missions, which may or you may not may not be able to do. So that's doesn't take very long. I know this is like an uh, an idle game, and I'm not really experienced with idle games, uh, unless I don't know. I don't know if Ark Knights is considered a, a, an art idle game because it has very similar mechanics as this game, where there's a lot of similar things. But I'm not sure if that's an idle game or not. But anyways, uh, where's more of the content? There's got to be more stuff coming because it's starting to become really boring. Waiting for outpost, and even outpost doesn't give you that much, even if you level it up, because outpost doesn't give uh, outpost doesn't give any more of of these core dust. It only gives out more XP and, and money. I don't need XP and money anymore. I need more core dust. <laughs> I need core dust here, guys. So even outpost is starting to fall off for me in my account, at least as you can see up there. I've got a lot of money. I've got way too much. Um, XP that I don't need anymore. Like, <laughs> look at all that. I need core dust. And so, there's not much content in this game, guys. Outpost is barely fleshed out. They're finally starting to work on it a little bit with the liberation system, but liberation system is not really content either. It's barely content. Like, you can barely even call it content. You go in there for like a few seconds and then you leave. And then eventually, maybe at one point, one point down the month, eventually you'll finally get a cutscene. That lasts for a few minutes and then that's over with already and then you're leaving again. Summoning, terrible in this game. Getting pilgrims, terrible. Molds, terrible. Yeah, you can get you can get lots of molds, but a lot of them don't come out with anything. And when you do, and I've experienced this many times by now, you get a really old unit that you don't want. Like for example, this video has this video has no structure anymore apparently. I I had a structure going into this, but now it doesn't have a structure anymore. But I've got so many of Eula who I don't want. Like I wouldn't be surprised if I can I got four of her. Four. Just from pulling from blue tickets and stuff. I don't want her. I don't want I want pilgrims. I still don't have a burst one pilgrim. I have a whole bunch of burst threes that are not very useful. Let me show you. You can still, by the way, if you if you put them in the synchro, you can still beat the first few levels here, even without any burst characters, like a one, two, and three. But eventually, it's gonna fall off. As you can see here, I have three burst, three characters on, on my pilgrim. And while you may say, "Oh, you're lucky to have those," uh, I want a burst one. I need a burst one. Actually, I didn't even know Noah was a pilgrim. He seems easier to pull than the than the main ones, but. 
There's gotta be more content in this game and there's gotta be better rates for molds. There's gotta be better, there's gotta be a lot of things that are better guys, seriously. Because a lot of things in this game are starting to fall off, for me at least. Um, I know I'm just doing random things while I'm talking, but things are starting to fall off a bit for me guys. Like there's gotta be more stuff in the, there's gotta be more stuff coming in the game other than just putting an event, putting in a banner and calling it a day. Uh, that works for a lot of older games that have, you know, established player bases and been, pl been on online for years, like Final Fantasy Brave Exvius, Dokkan Battle, you know, things like that. They can get away with it because they have a bunch of backlog content that you can go to if you're a new player. This game doesn't have a lot of backlog content. You do story mode, oh, I hit the wall, I can't do any more for right now. And then, uh, now what? So, now what do you do? Not much to do. So, there needs to be more, there should be like a backlog of events, there should be some trials that you can do in like a, a menu format instead of going into the story. There should be like new trials and bosses and things like that. There should be a lot of things coming out, but currently we're kind of in a state where they're being very slow. They do do some updates every now and then are, that are good, but then they, they, they take like 10 steps back where they're still not buffing molds. They're still not giving guaranteed uh, SSRs on, on tower molds and things like that. Oh, looks like I've got. Looks like I do. I can prove it right now. I've got. I've got this. And it, let me guarantee you, it's gonna give me an S, uh, SR. Yep, there it is. Perfect. Perfect visualization of this video. I know that the blue, purple ones are not the greatest, but at least it could be a, a good chance to get something at least. You know, because the pool of SSR characters are growing and growing, and you're gonna start feeling they're gonna be getting a lot more useless and useless characters that you don't want, like. Signal is okay, I guess, but you really want, you know, good characters like Drake and Maiden, Jackal. I want more Jackals, but she's not showing up. I want more Jackals. And you'll, you'll, instead you'll be getting characters like um, no Volume and Exia and y Yunwa, which I'm sure I've got a lot of. I've got two of her, so that's great. Perfect. Oh, Julia, 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 Julia. Got so many of her too. Got two of her, so that's great. Feels like I have. I should, feels like I have more of her, but apparently not. And I've got a lot of Viper, who apparently is not very good. Even though I, I reviewed her and I gave her a decent score. I think she's just very average. Anyways, this video is already going way too long for talking a bunch of nonsense. But in essence, in conclusion, I want more content in this game. There needs to be more content in this game. There should be a whole bunch more stuff to do instead of just playing for a few minutes and then leaving. Uh, that seems to be counterintuitive to what most, most mobile games want you to do, whereas they want you to stay in the in your in their app as long as possible, so you'll be tempted to to spend some money in their shop. But this game seems to be the opposite, and maybe that's a good thing for most people that they don't you know want to spend money, but. It's kind of the opposite of what you'd like to do in terms of, you know, a marketing strategy. Um, so hopefully going forward in the next few months, they'll start picking things up. They're not going to keep doing the same one banner, one event, and then put my hands up. I'm done for done for a long time, you know, kind of a thing, because the updates don't come up very often. They come up every, every you know, every few weeks. Um, so it's not like this game is being updated every week like other games are. All right, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think. Is this, are they going at a good pace? Or do you agree with me that they need, there needs to be more content? Liberation system is not really content. And the arc, stuff in the arc is already falling off in terms of, you know, being interesting. It actually fell off a long time ago, but you know what I mean. And union raids are like whale territory. If you're not in a huge union, you're not gonna get very far. Let me just plug mine very quickly here, guys. <laughs> If you haven't joined mine yet, go ahead and join. It's Deus Union ID 7557. I don't think you need to see anything in here, nope. But that's it. I think I've spoken more than enough of my mind. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.